Good morning, everyone. Today is very exciting because I am actually getting my furniture delivered today. So today's Monday. Hello. Welcome back to my channel. I'm Kinsey. If you guys are new here, subscribe, follow me on Instagram, all that stuff. But yeah, they, CB2 really messed with my order and then it was gonna be delivered like a week late and now it's getting delivered today, which I'm really excited for. Um, it's currently 8.40. I'm on my way to a core power yoga class. I was gonna take all true fusion this week just cause I have that membership thing. But um, now that my furniture's coming, I wanted to take a class a little bit earlier. Quentin is now at my house because he's staying there in case it gets there early, I kind of doubt it. And I'm taking my first um, core power yoga class, which I'm really excited for. It's a core power sculpt I'm taking from the one at West Village. Um, I feel like I would normally take from Henderson, but this is the only one that worked out time-wise. So. I'm really excited and then I come home and I self tan that needs to happen and then I also um, Get all my furniture Which is so exciting because like the downstairs will be like pretty much so set and done which is like the best thing ever um, I'm really excited. Oh my gosh. I'm so excited and I'm really excited to try out core power It was like a very last-minute decision I'm so used to having to book my classes so far in advance and like you don't have to book classes for the most part in Dallas like, I have called multiple places. I'm like, hey, it's not allowing me to book. And they're like, oh, just show up. And I was like, what? That's actually a really good thing. Okay, so I will give you guys my review of Core Power. I'm really, really pumped for it, obviously. It's on this road, so I'm just going to go. Look, it literally has to be right here, I think. Core Power. Oh, I found it. Okay, I'm so excited. Daylight told me that I would love this class. So if I don't love it, that is on her that is a 20 minute parking limit so it's gonna be a no for me all right so this is the core power i'm taking from i'm pumped this is not even the closest one to me but i'm excited guys first off comment down below podcast recommendations lately i've been loving okay sis as we know i love mood these are all my friends uh skinny confidential any i love it in my life i love so many shows i hope this is where i order and i want more but i'm at starbucks i drove 10 minutes out of the way to just go through a drive there. So, we're here we are. Starbucks today. Hi, how are you? I'm doing well, how are you doing? My gosh, guys, I have 1947 and I have a reward. So, my money on my Starbucks card will cover this. These are the exciting things in life. Anyways, I'm going home. My furniture, I don't think it's been delivered yet because no one's told me at least. Um, I loved Core Power. I honestly felt like it was more similar to Hot Pilates, like that class specifically, because I took a sculpt, than even Hot Pilates at True Fusion. Um, but I want to try both. I have a free week at Core Power, so I'm going to double up on workouts this week to see which one I like and really loving. But I love Core Power. It's also closer to me. So, like, I have to drive 15 minutes to True Fusion, which is, like, nothing. But I could literally, like, not drive. So, that's the other thing. Um, also, there's like a personal trainer. My thing is I'm thinking I might get a trainer, work out with them three days a week, and then do core power or something like that. That might be it. Um, but I want to try their heated classes, and I really want to try the candlelight class because I feel like I would love that. Like, ooh, you know, so nice. I'm excited because I can finally live my life because I can see my friends this week. I think I'm going to throw a housewarming thing this weekend. I've been thinking about a lot of things. So, yep, I mean, I'm pumped. My BFF is here and has been waiting for this furniture delivery that has not shown up. Showed up. So this is about to look very, very different, but I have my Starbucks order. Here you guys go. I know, normally I get questions. Comment down below your favorite Starbucks order because I need new ones. I want to do a video where I try out a different healthy Starbucks drink for a week, every day of the week. I just made that more confusing than it needs to be, but let me know if you guys would like that. You guys know that I'm really obsessed with the egg white egg bites. I'm actually, I need to go to Trader Joe's today and I'm gonna hopefully, oh, I don't have a muffin tray. I need to get that. I wanna make these from home because I'm so obsessed with them and they're so freaking good. So hopefully that is what I will be doing at some point today. All right guys, I'm actually the worst person ever. Um, so 11.30 crept around and I was like, that's so weird, why is the CB2 here? Um, they're actually coming tomorrow. So, Quinton had to come and stay here for two hours for no reason while I went to my workout class. But, it's I'm so fine. sorry. I'm not crying. She's crying. Q works, he normally works like afternoons on and then he works out before. So, it didn't like really mess up his schedule because he was able to do things here. But, yeah, I need to start drinking my coffee. Um, so, since I don't have furniture here... I like have to work. I don't want to sit out those chairs all day even though they are 
really comfy so i'm for the next two hours gonna work for my room which i really don't love doing but gotta do what you gotta do people my tv is being mounted today so this right here that literally something like this right here is my swag every time i hear that um i got a tv that will be mounted cannot find my apple tv remote anywhere so until quentin moves in to his place on saturday i'm gonna take his apple tv that he has because he's staying at my dad's at my dad's and then i'm sure it will turn up my rug comes today though that does come um and my bed does but i can't set that up my mom is coming on Tuesday, which is tomorrow. Actually, got the day right. Um, and she's gonna like put furniture together and help me with the gallery wall and all that stuff. And then my other furniture will be here, which will be so fun. But yeah, Q, I'm literally so sorry. I walked downstairs and I was like, I am so sorry. I still got this. You can use your, you can get the Apple TV remote app on your phone. But don't you have to set it up with your remote? Yeah, so this is always my problem. Also, Coco has a little grooming appointment on Thursday because she looks like a moth. We love you though, Coco. You look really cute. I self-tan too, so that's how my face looks like this. Bentley, oh, my parents are picking him up at 5 p.m., which is so sad. We will miss you so much. Everyone in this family is so obsessed with him. If you guys just had the chance to spend a minute with Bentley, you would fall in love. Like, he's just the perfect dog. He's legit the Coco, perfect. you're also great, and we love you. You look like a mob right now, girl. I'm so sorry for this. Um, but Bentley's just so sweet. Bentley's also, like, older and just whatever, but, yeah. He's just the sweetest, and so are you, Coco. We love you. All right, guys. I hate that I'm editing on my bed right now because I'm just so tired because I've been sitting here. It's currently 2.30. I just finished editing my vlog from this weekend. It took me a lot longer than I thought I would. Oh, my God. Look at her. Both the puppies are just sleeping right here. But yeah. So um, I had some packages delivered. My bed got delivered. I think some chairs for my kitchen table, my rug, and a few other things got delivered. Anyways, in 25 minutes, um, my guy is coming. Oh my gosh, I need to get my hair done. Like literally, what is that? I have an appointment Thursday, thank God. Um, but anyways, the guy is coming to mount my TV in 25 minutes so i'm gonna go ahead and go downstairs and like do the rug and stuff and then i'll probably work more for my room and then i'm gonna look for office furniture because i definitely need that um but i'm just so excited like tonight sydney's coming over and to do my first Tinder joe's run i'm really excited for that and i don't know why um yeah i'm just like really looking forward to it and it's gonna be a great time so tomorrow maddie trap is coming over That'll be fine, and my furniture will get here in the morning, and I'm just ready. Here's the before. All right, guys, I have four of the six acrylic chairs right here. That's great. I made myself some coffee. Um, the guys should be here soon. I got a lot of more pack. I got so many more packages. My rug actually didn't come. That was totally a different package than I was thinking. I have two big chairs to sit on the ends of these. Um, all those will be hung up, and then... Yeah, my table will come tomorrow, which I'm so excited for. I picked up this ring from Amazon that was like $20. Life hack, Amazon has really, this is not the best ring I've ever seen. Like a lot of them look nicer, but Amazon has all these rings that look like you got them from like the M Jewelers at least. So they're like 200, but they're really like 20 bucks a piece. I'll add a whole shop page to my Amazon shop and you guys can shop Amazon's really cheap jewelry. It's the best thing ever. This one will go on my thumb. It's cool. Guys, Bentley is just sitting there. Like, he's literally the cutest thing I've ever seen in my life. My tip to personalizing your house but still making it cool would be to frame vinyls of your favorite record. So, I have some already framed. I have a Drake one. I'll show you guys. Um, actually, no, I only have the Drake one framed. I want to get, I, I actually did order the Destiny's Chad one from Urban, but unfortunately, it was delivered to the wrong address. So, I got this one on Amazon, and I got this originally from Urban, so it's my second one I purchased. But just getting frames like this to make it look nicer, not the vinyl frames that are like thin. It has to be like the nicer ones. I'll, again, I'll link this on my Amazon shop page for home. Um, honestly, I could even have done bigger with this, but it's cool too because if I wanted to stack them and not put them on the gallery, I have two that are the same size, you know what I mean? So like in a bathroom, it would be cool. Ta-da, it looks so good. Okay, so I didn't necessarily want another Drake one, but um, I was sent this by a label a long time ago, so I already had it. These just kind of match the color scheme of my apartment or my house as well. 
So I love that. I already have like two frame things of Drake just because basically this whole wall is kind of just like pop culture. Like it's funny and it's cool. And then it's like Mona Lisa holding a Gucci bag, you know? That's Drake. Um, there's another one, like another vinyl of his because we had it um, in the old house and my old roommate just randomly framed it. I wanted the TLC even though I love Drake, but for now, I think I'm gonna keep the Drake and see, because honestly, it looks better together, but now it looks like I'm really obsessed with Drake, you know? All right, guys, I got my two big chairs. So this is gonna be the little arrangement, and then there will be a table in the middle of there. I just sent a photo of this to Q, and I was like, me and all my friends. Ha ha, funny, right, B? Oh my gosh, guys, he's getting picked up at five. I'm really upset about it, he's so freaking cute. I just put a hoodie on. It is raining, so I'm finally venturing out to Trader Joe's. My hair just, oh, it's rough. And I had to move my hair appointment this week because I have a meeting then and now. So it's just going to keep looking rough. But yeah, this is what I'm wearing. I just have some sweats from Champion. Like, wow, this is a really great outfit, guys. Um, Yeezys and then my Twin Flames hoodie. I love it. It is currently... 4.54 p.m. I just finished some schoolwork. Look at this for myself tan. I thought I washed it off. Great, you know? Um, but I'm on my way to Trader Joe's, which I'm really going to be cutting close. I have to be back in 30 because my stepdad's picking up Bentley, sadly. But it's my first Trader Joe's run in my new Trader Joe's, which is very exciting because I love Trader Joe's and I also need food. So... That is what we're doing right now. Um, I'm gonna cook tonight. I only have an air fryer, so we're gonna make do. Guys, I just spent 150, 60 something dollars at Trader Joe's within like eight minutes. Here I was worrying that I wasn't even gonna be making it back in time for my stepfather and I was in and out in 10 minutes, um, but it was so expensive because I had to get like all of my staples, so like, all the seasoning and the sauces and whatever. I mean, like, I literally have nothing. So, yeah. Anyways, I didn't even really get things for recipes because I can't cook cook until Friday because I will have pots and pans. But I do have an air fryer, so I can do some things with that. But, yeah. Anyways, it's raining. And today, this vibe is just so cozy and homey. And I love it. Like, seriously. I, am unpopular opinion, really actually don't like LA weather because it's sunny every day and it's the same thing every day. And I love rain and like gloomy. I just like seasons and stuff, you know? Not that it like snows here, but I like Texas seasons because it's kind of like perfect. So I'm heading home. I'm gonna put my groceries away. And then Sid's so coming over soon. And say goodbye to B. I'm so sad. Oh, my rug came in too so we can get that. Also, Quentin just texted me and he literally just ran into Janine at Equinox, which is funny. I didn't even know she was in town. Four bags. I am constantly out of breath because of the stairs in this house which is gonna be good for me, but it's very odd because I actually work out all the time. Here's what I picked up. So this is what I got, it's so unorganized. For the time being, I'm using this as my pantry until I build out in the actual like walk-in pantry that I have. So it's that box stuff, the stuff that I reach for it more often, then some bags, some, some more stuff, more seasoning, brown sugar, nutritional yeast, all that stuff. Um, but obviously I have my two Trader Joe's favorites. These are my biggest staples that I own. I can't take my hand seriously. Um, so that's what I have in there. And then in here, I just got a lot of broccoli. Half of what I eat is literally broccoli. Salmon, that's the other half. All right guys, I'm on my phone because my camera battery died and I did get a new one that's being delivered by 8 a.m. tomorrow. So sorry, it's gonna be on my phone for a second. I hope the quality is not too bad. I don't know. I started vlogging um, to show you guys what I picked up from the grocery store. All right, so I just did the rug. Um, honestly, probably should have gotten a size up because I feel like the coffee table is going to end up taking most of the space. Um, I don't know. Honestly, the only thing I can think of is like I'm going to see it tomorrow and see how I like it. And I might move this rug here. I wasn't going to do a rug here and then get another. Like, I don't know. We'll have to see. It'll have to all come together. For me to make my final decision but i definitely feel like i should have gone up a size and on the website it looked different like i do like it but it looks like it was more stripes like honestly it almost looked like that blanket but yeah i definitely feel like i needed a bigger size so i don't know we'll see tomorrow we'll just have to figure it out then good morning everyone my furniture came in the mail i ordered a new like, on the Amazon Prime Now camera charger, and, like, it just didn't charge my battery, so I had to just Postmates 
a new vlog camera thing, so I'm still on my phone, and I'm really sorry, because this is like only my most exciting vlog, you know? My table came in, looks amazing. All of that's coming out. My mom and Quentin are here. Um, coffee table, chairs are already here, TV got set up, and then my couch, which you guys will see more of this when my battery comes. Just wanted to give you guys an update. It looks so cute. All right, we just got Starbucks, bacon egg bites. I feel like my entire vlogs are always bacon egg bites. This Oatmeal. So we all got order the same thing without even realizing it. We've started on the gallery wall. My charger for my vlog camera will be here soon. And then here's my drink. The Maddie Trap drink. All right, so my mom is helping me, AKA hanging the um, gallery wall. She has this nice little trick. You guys can follow her interior design Instagram, linked below. But yeah, this is gonna look really good. Also, I think I found some good stuff for my office, which I don't need to buy right now because I spent, like literally need to stop spending money. But it's looking good. All right, guys, my mom just um, hung all of these. They look so freaking good. Guys, oh my gosh, first off, the heater is on and it's freaking hot in here. But wow, it looks so good. Starting on the dresser. Oh, I really am, don't know if we're, oh, okay, let's, oh my gosh, updates to come, guys. We just had to take so much furniture up two flights of stairs. This is a lot of parts. Yeah, I'm, this is a lot. I normally pay for someone to assemble it, but that wasn't an option when I checked out. So we're gonna give it our best shot. So we are almost done with the dresser. I just made dinner in the air fryer. This is like all I have. I don't even have most of my stuff. So just salmon and broccoli. Broccoli has a really like dark seasoning on it, but it's so good. You guys in here. We're almost done with the dresser. My manager's coming over. I have a call with my YouTube team in 20 minutes. So my manager's just gonna come over and we're gonna take it here. And she can see the new place. Maddie Trap is also on her way. We're gonna go take a hot like. Sorry guys, my camera battery keeps dying, but my manager's coming over, we're taking a call from my YouTube team, Maddie Trapp's coming over, we're taking candlelit yoga tonight, and yeah, the dresser is almost done. I'm gonna see if my mom wants to eat right now. Listen here upstairs. Guys, surprise, surprise. My, oh yeah, Maddie's here. Um, surprise, surprise, my camera is not, it's dead again. When I've been putting, it's just been on the charger. Like something is up. And I've gone through, I got two new chargers today. So, it's not the battery though. I mean, that would make more sense. <laughs> Anyways, we're core power. Um, we're taking a candle lit class. I'm really excited. Maddie's first time, my second time. Gonna be great. We're kind of like creeping on this class right now to see what they're doing. But ours is gonna be candle lit, so it's not that. Yeah, I know. I'm looking forward to that. And that's the part that's gonna be really great, so. Um, yeah, my- I think guy's butt crack is shine. <laughs> great great my mom i went upstairs when i took the call and my mom had started working on the bed and i felt bad and now she's like really focused in by getting frustrated my mom typically when she's frustrated is like more like sat on doing it so i just kind of had to like let her have it and so we'll see if my bed is worked like the dresser is kind of messed up we'll just figure it out it's really i don't know i'm probably gonna have to hire some of my handy tomorrow so we'll see all right guys so sorry but we are vlogging on my phone still the chargers are not working and it's it's i don't think it's the battery it's because there's two prongs and they both just are not good so i ordered the canon original one i have no idea like honestly i'm wondering at this point if the charger is at my dad's house so i'm gonna go over there even though i just ordered another one it's just good to have multiple for some reason this is the one thing in life i lose but anyways um happy wednesday i think maddie slept over we are about to make some coffee and then we're gonna go do some work at Lolling Cafe. They have like amazing toast. So I'm excited for that. I kind of want to make toast at home. I still haven't decided. It was so nice last night. I was cooking right here, had the TV going, candles burning, amazing. Um, I'm gonna burn my Casey Musgraves candle. I like don't ever want to burn it because I just want it to last it forever. Wow, it's so beautiful. <laughs> Good morning, everyone. Um, I found my vlog camera charger literally at my dad's house. <laughs> We're at Lola Land Cafe. I'm gonna vlog when we get outside, but I'm so happy. Any coffee, but I don't get more. I hate all these uh, noises. I'm like really irritable as of this week. <laughs> I hate everything, apparently. Are you good? <laughs> I'm like. 
Is that even what you're supposed to do? <laughs> <We'll call. laughs> I don't know. You did it very happily, though. <laughs> you're choking. <laughs> All right, guys. So we went to La La Land. Um, my camera has been dead, as we know. It's now charged. So we were there for a few hours. Um, I emailed so many people. I need to change this clock, but anyways. Their avocado toast is so good, by the way. If it is really go good, there, see? They put like a lot of lemon in the avocado. That's the secret to so good avocado good. toast. Mm -hmm. And, I mean, like, they have so much, everything's good. It's like, where I work, I don't even eat our avocado toast. Like, a lot of people do, I just don't like it. Yeah. Not enough flavor, but when you do the lemon, it changes the it, game. It changes everything. Yeah. I'm actually thinking about that avocado toast, and I agree. Yeah. Okay, so this is like a strawberry matcha. Oh, it's like really, really good. Yeah. Like you can taste the strawberry, but it's definitely not overwhelming. Like the other one I had was very sweet yeah. and less matcha. -y. She got two. And this one is, yeah. I'm a big foodie. I have to yeah. try everything. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's yeah, like yeah. a Valentine's Day special, I think. Dang. I just feel like I'm not awake right now, even though I'm definitely awake. You know what I mean? Yeah. Wait, okay. We can talk about our core power experience last night. So we went to a hot yoga. It was candlelit. Candle we thought it was going to be zen. It was like totally a workout. But it was so well, really yeah. good. No, I thought I knew it was gonna be a workout so but I, I feel like that was not that hard. When I think of yoga, like when I've done yoga in the yeah. past, it's not really anything where I'm like out of breath, if yeah. that makes sense. Now maybe that's because I'm naturally a very flexible person, yes. so a lot of the things are not very difficult for me. For other people they can be. And I understand that people have, do yoga who have a lot of pain and stuff like that. Yeah. But that was like Pilates yoga. But it was, yeah, Pilates. Okay, so like they have a sculpt class that's like five times harder than that class. Yeah. So the harder classes are more comparable to Pilates, but it's still not as hard as Pilates. But there is this guy. Okay, well, first off, we go to the class. It was cool. We liked it. Um, we go to a new location. Um, all great, all fine, great, whatever. There's this girl behind me who's like really good. And so I'm following her at the beginning. And I'm like, oh, I'll just follow what she does, whatever. Amazing. All of a sudden, she's upside down. Like, they're like doing all these crazy Every time they gave you like the option to do more, <laughs> she would do it. But she, she would already like, be doing it. Yeah. She wouldn't even, yeah. She was swole, tatted, like beautiful woman. Yeah. Like super friendly, like very nice. Cause I heard people going up to her and saying, like, wow, you were amazing and all this stuff after. And she was very nice about it. But yes. I was like watching her and then I was like, I was like, I want she was, like, to be a on that level. At one point. Like it was really like, yeah, amazing. And then at the end of it, the other guy who was good starts singing. So imagine it's like a Zen candlelit yoga class. I call it yoga. But her playlist was weird. So like oh. her playlist like started off like kind of mild. It was like her. I think we decided it was her. To Halsey. To Halsey. And then it John was John like, Mayer at one point. John Mayer and Adele and like DJ like a DJ Khaled song and then a normal Khaled song. Yeah. Khalid, whatever you say. Then the guy with the Khalid song, he's literally like scream like not screaming the lyrics, but he's singing audibly. Like we can all hear oh, him. Oh, the Khalid then, song. I thought you talked to DJ Khaled. Sorry, no. yes. And then the instructor is like talking and he's kind of almost singing over her. Like I was very distracted by his singing. It was weird. Like, and then on top of it, the playlist is so bizarre. And she does the whole thing. She's going through like the seven deadly sins, something uh -huh. like that. So she goes through like sex and she's like, sexual intercourse is not bad. And then she like keeps saying this. And the guy is like singing. singing and John Mayer was just playing. And like, it's, it was literally the weirdest playlist ever. I totally ever. got what she was trying to do with that no, stuff. No, it wasn't. The was cool. But there were some times when she would say stuff and I'm, I would be like, you gotta be careful who you say that around yeah. because somebody might take issue with like what you're saying. Yes. Because she was basically saying like limit yourself in sex and a lot of girls these days are more liberal with sex and are okay with doing that and don't have issues with it. So I'm like, you gotta be careful like what yeah. you're preaching because well, some of her point, stuff was a little more like superiority complex and not just like yeah. this is how I think. It was like, this is what's right. Yeah. If that makes sense. Yeah. It was just like, a, it was honestly like nothing even, it was just the combination of all of it. And I was like, wait, it was just like, I honestly kind of felt like I was in some like funny TV show. Yeah, it was so weird. It was just the combination of everything. Kenzie would look at me and be like, <laughs> oh. <laughs> like, like I was trying not to like laugh, but whatever. It was still a good class. Like she was great. Yeah, you know, it whatever. was awesome. I still really liked it. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Well, here we go. I need to figure out. We're gonna listen to Usher today. Oh! Usher, Summer Walker. Yes. So I am home. Oh my gosh. Okay, I forgot to update you guys on my bedroom stuff. 
My nightstand's done, my bed is done. There's one nightstand that isn't done, and then for the dresser, they messed it up, and there's like a few pieces missing. So I have to email them or call them today so that they can expedite some, and then hopefully my stepdad or someone can fix it this weekend. If not, I don't know what I'm gonna do. Um, I still don't have a mattress right now, so like I'm not even in the room. It's not the biggest deal. But yeah, anyways, I got home to a package from American Eagle. I'm working with them on a video soon, and I'm actually like, I'm so impressed by the stuff, guys. Um, it's just so cute. So this is so freaking soft. It's this gray crew neck. I'll probably throw it on, honestly, after this. Then this little gray, little cropped kind of, it's not cropped, but it, it's not like, you know what I'm saying. Um, a little like mock neck, I believe that's what it's called. So soft. Then I got a brown one, which this one is, like, I cannot describe to you guys how soft this stuff is. And then these jeans are really cool. These honestly look like a pair of girlfriend denim jeans that I really want. So love that. And then I got another pair, which you can never have enough pairs. And then I randomly got a flannel because I was just feeling getting a flannel. I haven't worn a flannel since like freshman year of high school, honestly. But yeah, I'm really excited about this stuff. This will be in an upcoming video that you guys will see, but it's like so freaking soft. Oh my gosh. Yeah. Guys, look who's here. Hey guys. My first YouTube visitor. Before yes. Janine came over, I was watching Cheers, you can see on Netflix. But oh, I was just watching that. It's so good. I just started it's it today. It back to all my cheer days. Like, yes. All my old cheer teams on there. My old cheer, uh, like one of the guys that did our choreography was on this. I was like, mm -hmm. oh my gosh, I miss it. No, like, there's so many people. I watch this and it's like, I have so many people. I know so many people who are on this teams. My sister cheered for them. Wow. Your sister cheered for Navarro? For cheer athletics. Oh, okay. okay yeah. But... It's been a great time catching up. Um, yeah. yeah, it is weird watching cheer though because it's like literally like we are literally in the place that it. Yeah. You know. Legit. And yeah. I've been to Navarro. Like we did a yeah. cheer show up there, and I was like, this is weird. Our best family friends, the daughter, cheered for them like recently, but she just got married. So, anyways, it was great catching up. Yeah. So basically, I just been working from home today. Janine came over just for a little bit, like a few hours ago, um, and we caught up, and that was fun. I actually just booked. Um, our Nashville trip, so, okay, it's so weird, I just booked an Airbnb for, like, almost $2,000, and they charged to two of my accounts, because there was problems with the payment, and then they're saying they only charged me, like, once, but it's probably just confusion, whatever, so, I booked my, I booked the Airbnb, and then I just booked my flights, which is very exciting. Let me make sure. I'm like now afraid that that, yeah, no, I did it Monday 12th to the 16th. So the Airbnb is booked, the flights are booked. I'm really excited. I've confirmed, um, I have a few confirmed guests that I'm pumped about, but this is like the first time I'm going remote, which is something I really want to do um, a lot more of this year. So I'm excited. Um, I'm on my couch. I was just watching some YouTube videos. I'm watching the L song association videos. I don't know why I keep watching them, um, but I found out JoJo has one, and JoJo's one of my favorite artists. But yeah, today has been a heavy computer workload day. I've basically just been sitting at that table for hours, besides when Janine came over for like 30 minutes, but that is gonna be the end of this vlog. I hate that I wasn't able to vlog more with Maddie last night, but um, like you guys already know. So I'm sorry for that, but I hope you guys enjoyed. Um, I am gonna be filming a weekend of my life vlog, which is gonna be exciting because I'm gonna have a little housewarming thing, I think, on Saturday for family. Um, Friday's Valentine's Day. Tomorrow, I'm gonna start on Thursday, um, which is not the weekend, I know, but tomorrow I have like meetings and I'm doing some fun stuff. So, hope you guys enjoyed today's vlog. Subscribe if you guys haven't already, and I'll see you guys soon. Bye.